what is up gang thank you for checking out sledgehammer tv today the battle for subscription box supremacy rages on with september's edition of the subscription box showdown right here today what kind of cool shit did we get we're gonna find out together and i'm gonna let you guys know who you voted for as last month's champion on the subscription box showdown right here on sledgehammer tv i'm nick nightmare let's do it Alright gang, thank you so much for tuning back into the subscription box showdown. You all know if you've been watching, this is my absolute favorite show because I love getting wrestling stuff. What wrestling fan doesn't love getting wrestling stuff? And nobody has been bringing it harder than that wrestling club over the last few months. And last month in the August edition, if you missed it, go check it out. It was the absolute closest battle we have ever had and I had to turn to you guys my fans to help me choose the winner for the first time in the history of the subscription box showdown and I think from this moment on that's how we are going to do things so don't forget today to also in the comments leave your choice for who you think wins out in the month of September and also let me know which of the items we unbox today was among your favorite ones that I received so that I know that your vote is genuine and that we can get a true tally on who is the champion for September. But as for last month, the winner with 75% of the vote and still your subscription box showdown heavyweight champion of the world that wrestling club drink it in man take a look it's all yours baby this beautiful piece of hardware which we constructed by hand ourselves to award to the winner each and every month well well deserved last month's box was absolutely fantastic wrestle crate Definitely brought the thunder. They gave me a Cody Rhodes American Nightmare pop, and they had some really good stuff. They have been getting better and better every single month. Let's see if this month continues the trend, or if for the first time in history, WrestleCrate will be the ones bringing enough to the dance to get this belt. Look at this thing, man. Look at it. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at it shining in the light. Look at the shimmer going on. All right, this is legit. You guys got to give me some good stuff to earn this, and that wrestling club has been the champion for the last six to seven months, maybe even more. We are going to find out right now if they still have what it takes. We are going to kick this thing off, as always, with the challenger, WrestleCrate. Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it is time for September's WrestleCrate. And I am very excited coming off the heels of the very good box they gave us last month. Let's waste no more time and let's get right to the action as WrestleCrate enters the ring for September 2018. Professor Exacto, please do the honors, my good friend. And let's release the tape, flip this lid, and see if I flip my lid. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 my God, WrestleCrate, woo-hoo-hoo, look at this shit, man, the Hardy Boys, two-pack, what, two-pack of one of the greatest tag teams in all of the world, and to make it even better, this is not just any Matt Hardy, this is Woken Matt Hardy with a white streak in there. Unfucking believable! Holy cow! This one piece alone worth the price of admission for a monthly heavyweight box from WrestleCrate. I'm, I'm like shaking right now. I got goosebumps, man. If I could get in on there and show you, holy cow! 
Holy cow. With the exception of the autograph pieces, this might just be the best singular item I have gotten in any box ever. This is fucking amazing. Wrestle Crave, what? Bring in the Thunder this month. They must really have saw that belt. They must have really wanted it, man, huh? Let's check out what else we got. Here we go. We got a pin. Oh, this is a fucking awesome pin. Cup of coffee in the big time. Oh, yeah. Macho Madness, Randy Savage. Cup of coffee in the big time. Oh, yeah. I love that phrase. Many of you guys probably remember it just as well as I do. And it's done. And if you can't tell the color, that's green. Looks like a Starbucks logo. I'm more of a Dunkin' Donuts kind of guy myself, but this is fucking great pin and you know what time it is everybody it's time to stick it so let's do it randy savage cup of coffee in the big time oh yeah let's put this box down before i cause more chaos oh yeah <laughs> wrestle crate man you are doing it right right now what do we got here some kind of foamy thing oh nice little wrestle crate drink koozie can dig that we're gonna take our beer and we're gonna put it right in here right now I'm gonna show you guys how it works All right check it out keeps your hands from getting wet from the condensation keeps your drink from going warm it's fantastic I love that they gave me a, a nice other one uh, very very at the beginning I think it was a Dean Ambrose or something like that that doesn't matter. Let's talk about what we got this month. Let's get to the t-shirt. We got a nice gray. I love gray. Nice charcoal gray. Very good. What do we... Oh, very nice. The Canadian Destroyer, Petey Williams. One of my favorite guys from back in the day of TNA Wrestling. The Canadian Destroyer. If you have not seen this maneuver, it's absolutely breathtaking. It's been one of my favorite maneuvers. I'm glad not many people do it because it's a very dangerous one. I am not from Canada, eh? But I will be wearing this shirt. I absolutely love this. This is a great shirt, you guys. Fantastic. Let's throw it over into the pile and let's get to the rest of this thing. What we got here? We got an autograph picture of Captain Charisma. Christian. The only member of all of the tag teams that made TLC history, that's not in the Hall of Fame yet. How about that? Looking forward to Edge and Christian's podcast of awesomeness and also their show on the WWE Network. Pretty good stuff. Not bad. I like this autograph. Very, very big time. Awesome crate from Wrestle Crate for September. 2018 they did not skimp on the cheat sheet again thank you let's go down the list exclusive canadian destroyer t-shirt the most devastating move from the most polite place in the world sorry about your head a eh? that's what it says here i don't know i definitely first was exposed to it from pd williams many people have been using it since then i absolutely love it it's fantastic hardy boys funko pop set the most extreme brothers in wrestling. You don't want to delete these Matt and Jeff Hardy Funko Pops. You're damn right I don't. Absolutely fantastic. Cup of coffee in the big time. Enamel pin. I used to do that much better. I don't know what happened to my voice in my old age. Wrestle Crate exclusive Christian autograph and the Wrestle Crate koozie. If you did not get the top level, you did not get the Hardy Boys Funko Pop set or the koozie this month. The rest of this stuff was for every level and everybody got to enjoy this. This is a fucking great box, Wrestle Cray. Oh my God, the gauntlet has been thrown down. And September's edition looks like it may be even closer than last month's. I need you guys now more than ever. Make sure you let me know what was your favorite item in that box down in the comment section below as if i really have to ask as we get set to finish this battle off by bringing to the stage the reigning defending heavyweight champion of wrestling subscription boxes that wrestling club it's the club i love because they're awesome but they might be going down tonight let's get to it and see what's up Whoa, boy, you guys, big time. 
big time competition being dropped by the challenger i'm telling you guys i've been a member of wrestlecrate they were absolute they were actually the first box that i subscribed to and this is probably the best box they've ever given me ever ever but now let's bring the champ to the stage that wrestling club is the club i love you all know why every single pop vinyl that is signed sitting here to my left was given to me by them and this is a big deal box for you guys this could be the first box to lose we're gonna i can't even i can't take the the anticipation myself professor exact i'll get your ass out here let's do this september wrestling club oh my god i'm nervous I'm nervous for you guys. I can't I can't even take it. Let's do this. Let's open it up. What do we got here? I see another pop. What do we got? We got Vince McMahon. Mr. McMahon. Funko Pop. Let me tell you something. My Funko Pop collection has exploded over the last couple of months. Thanks in part to both of our contestants tonight. This is a great figure man however as i'm looking here on the box not not to take anything away from that wrestling club just when i see the other ones that are available there is a skull king triple h on the back of this box and if i would have got that i probably might have shit my pants in front of you guys right here on, on camera and it would have been not good for me but amusing for you guys nonetheless mr mcmahon in a very classic looking blue suit with the wwe microphone I wish I can get some better light on here for you guys. There you go. That's a little bit better, right? Awesome. Mr. McMahon. Fun to pop. I am loving this. Here's a t-shirt. We got a good t-shirt. What do we got here? Black. Oh, ho, 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 ho. big Van Vader. I love this shirt. I loved Vader. He was probably my favorite bad guy. In WCW, his matches with Sting and Ron Simmons from those eras, that those matches from those days, rather, are just simply not to be forgotten. This is great to wear in his memory. I love the red and black. It's a fantastic likeness of the guy. Vader forever. You're damn right. Vader forever. Fucking great t-shirt. Oh, man. Here we go. It's pin time. Who do we got here? I think that this pin is glorious but we're going to have to check the sheet cheat sheet just to be sure because literally it kind of could be anybody but i'm going with a guess of this being a bobby rude pin looks like the glorious pose looks like the glorious bastard himself who needs to turn heel before i kill myself when i watch him on smackdown live this is a cute caricature. I really enjoy this. I love all my pins, and you know what time it is. It's time to stick it. So let's get them up here. Bang! Now this pin board is glorious. Holy shit. I'm loving it. Let's continue on. We have a sticker here in the box. We have a sticker here. We got a Vader Forever sticker to match the t-shirt. I love this. I might strap this bad boy on my guitar. My guitar's red. This might look fucking awesome on my electric. I like this sticker. I'm a big sticker guy. I don't know why stickers make me happy. I enjoy getting them, and I enjoy sticking them as well. But I'm not going to show you where I stick that one because I can't get to it right now. And now we have an autographed picture. Wait a minute. Oh, 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 oh wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's, there's who? There's two autographed pictures in here, and I, I, look, <laughs> I can't even speak. We got, we got Alistair Black. The Alistair Black autograph is in my possession right now. Former NXT heavyweight champion of the world. This is one, one of two. This actually might be the bigger of the two for you guys, but I'm going to flip this some bitch over and you are going to see. Oh my god. Zelina Vega. This this is this makes me feel all kinds of things. <laughs> two. They see see what I mean? That wrestling club, I just can't make this decision anymore. These guys are coming at me 
WrestleCrate's coming at me with double pops, and we're getting double autographs now. Zelina Vega and Aleister Black, two of the biggest names in the WWE going right now. Are you kidding me? Oh my God. There better be nothing else in this box, because my heart might fucking explode. No, just, just, just the cheat sheet. The list of September, let's go down the checklist. Exclusive Vader t-shirt, Aleister Black autograph, Zelina Vega autograph, Vince McMahon pop, Vader sticker, and I was right, the glorious lapel pin. You see the picture of Aleister Black signing as proof. Holy shit, you guys. Two absolutely fantastic boxes. I am glad that I am throwing it to you guys because I definitely cannot make the choice. I cannot. Autographs have their value, but when they are of people that I love, like Aleister Black and Zelina Vega, it just totally amplifies it by a hundred. Their autographs definitely went out, but Wrestle Crate's pop definitely beats that wrestling club's pop. And then we had a couple of fantastic pins, which are actually pretty even if you ask me. Randy Savage and the Glorious pin, they're very, very even. How do you choose? This extra sticker, the koozie, the sticker and the koozie, that's pretty even as well. I need you guys to help me out. I want to know what your favorite item in each box was and what your favorite item over all of the items were. And then, of course, please, in the comment section down below, leave your choice for September's winner. Does that wrestling club still have what it takes to remain the champion next month? It's up to you guys to decide that please make sure you leave that down in the comments below or you can also take the poll in the upper right hand corner of your screen and choose which of the two boxes you enjoyed the most you could also reach out to me on twitter instagram facebook however you can get at me i am there just get me your votes so we can tally them up and tell you guys who the winner for next month is my god you guys what an absolutely amazing episode of this show amazing stuff that wrestling club take it in while you can man because the fans will have their say and unlike in the wwe we listen to our fans we don't just say we do and then blow you guys off we listen to our fans and it is in their hands and for the first time you guys might be in some serious serious trouble even more so than last month but as of right now you are the reigning defending champions will that remain next month it's up to you make sure you do all of that and then as well hit that like button if you enjoyed today's broadcast share this video with each and every one of your wrestling buddies all over the wrestling world especially if they would dig anything that i got in this box maybe they're big pop vinyl fans make sure they watch this episode so they can see pretty much how i orgasmed all over myself for both of these boxes in particular moments and it was just a whole great fun time to be had and more importantly than anything if you are still here at the end of this video and you enjoyed everything make sure and you are the biggest wrestling fan you probably know right yourself you're the biggest wrestling fan you know why aren't you watching this channel this is the channel for wrestling fans we are the biggest newest fastest rising podcast in all of youtube baby and we are here for wrestling fans just like you so what you need to do is hit that subscribe button right now we are well over that 800 hump we are tiptoeing our way to that 1k and you can help us get there even quicker by hitting that subscribe button right now don't forget to stay notified by hitting that ring bell next to it so that every time an awesome video from sledgehammer tv is dropped you will know that it's there for your viewing pleasure and you can peruse it at your leisure my name is nick nightmare this has been the subscription box showdown my absolute favorite show to do on my channel i hope you guys enjoyed yourself today don't forget to like share and subscribe that my friends is going to do it and we're out of here and we will see you next time right here on the sledgehammer wrestling shows subscription box showdown the show of champions baby <laughs> have a good one